Hey, what's up guys? This is an update um, on my second pair of jeans. In my last video, I showed you an old pair and a new pair. So this is an update on the new pair. I'm gonna show you how to do this to the pair of jeans. As you can see, I definitely had an impact on the left leg. Um, so I'm gonna show you some awesome tools I used. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't do it outside because my ideas happen to sprout late at night into the hours of early in the morning. So I had to do it inside in the bathtub. But um, this actually could work for you. It might um, work better inside than outside. So but personally me, I have to do it inside because it's too dark outside. Um, but let's dive right into this and um, let's get started. Now here are some of the new materials I'm gonna be introducing, which is uh, nothing special but <laughs> bleach. I'm gonna be bleaching one of the backside legs up to the ankle or up to, yeah, up to the kneecap, uh, totally white on the back. And then I'm also introducing this thing, um, it's a filer. <laughs> so um, I'm actually gonna be filing down some of the metal buttons. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but you have little metal buttons. Metal buttons. So I'm pretty much gonna be filing down uh, those things with uh, this uh, filer. And uh, this is a really good filer, it's metal, and it's uh, it will get the job done. Remember, when using bleach, you're going to want to use gloves as well, by the way, because it will burn your hands a little bit, because I have sensitive skin, so uh, it felt like there was a thousand suns on my hand. So this is how the jeans turned out. I think they turned out absolutely great. Um, uh, just what I wanted was pretty much like a little bit of bleach here. All, I mean, totally white here, then slowly fading to other stuff. Unfortunately, um, I put a little bit too much up here, so there's big blocks everywhere. Um, I kind of don't like that. There's a little bit way too much, but I'm actually kind of digging it. It's kind of growing on me a little bit. Um, when you do bleach jeans, um, when I bleach jeans at least, the other side is going to be bleached as well. So for the idea of having something over here kind of change my perspective a little bit I actually might want to keep this because this actually looks kind of cool because it's like totally faded here into white and then totally faded into here and then like big blotches everywhere um, I threw some over here as well um, a lot of it got bleached here but I can always cover that with a patch or I can always uh, make that go away so that's not worrying too much but uh, yeah it's pretty much the way I wanted it to come out um, the front is Pretty much the same, but again, these are bleached front and these are totally blank. A little bit of bleach spots here and the big bloops here. Um, these are kind of annoying me, but again, they're kind of growing on me. And I think once I put a patch here, it will take my eye off here and it will definitely correspond with each other well. Um, I still got a lot more work to do, but um, that's pretty much it. I think it's looking really good actually, in my opinion. Guys, I wanted to thank you so much for viewing this video. Um, I had a lot of fun doing it as well. I had um, fun showing you what the 
process of making jeans is like. Um, I do hope I gave you some kind of cool skills. Um, please comment and subscribe down there, that'd be awesome. Uh, also, my next video, um, I'm probably going to be showing you a video of the jeans, what they look like when they're on and they're finished completely. So that'd be really cool. I don't know when I'm going to post that. Um, I also have another project in mind, um, and I'll give you a hint, and that's something to do with a leather jacket, pretty much, and a missing sleeve. Um, if anybody can get that movie reference, I'll give you the biggest hug ever. Again, it's going to be a leather jacket with a missing sleeve. Um, look forward to that, and I'm definitely going to show some uh, other gaming videos as well. Uh, thanks so much for tuning in and viewing this video if you have, um, and I'll catch you guys later.